Hello, Team Taurus. It's Empire 333 here. Welcome to your love re tarot reading, Taurus. Okay, we'll be getting into your energy, your person's energy, whoever's has you on their mind, okay? And then we'll be sp picking up some guidance from Spirit here. All the information you need to know about me is down below in the description box, Taurus. Okay, I'm open for personal readings. So let's see, my Taurus people. Um, Taurus, your mind is full, okay? I don't know what you're nervous about, what you're stressing out about at this time, but let's see what's going on with your energy. I just heard as the pendulum swings. So there could have been something in the past that either was a no and it's turning into a yes, or it could be it was a yes and it's turning into a no, okay? So um, let's pick up on what this energy is. <clears throat> Spirit, what energies are toward my Taurus people in? my bills okay tree of life Ooh, two of cups the death card okay taurus this is what i'm getting from your energy some of you you just want the forever after right you want someone to commit with you want someone to um, grow old with, whatever it is, right? This has to do with um, putting down some solid roots. And what I'm seeing here is that for some of you, you might have thought, taught, oh my God, thought, <laughs> the person that you were recently with was the person that could have been your forever after, okay? I feel that some of you, um, you connected with a very deep soulmate level person, okay? Um, this is a Scorpio card, guys, okay? Um, this, these are just energies, but I'll, I'll tell you what signs also come up. But what I'm getting about this is that something changed between you and someone else, okay? There was a connection here. I do see that the love or the care you had for one another was pretty strong, okay? But something changed. Something transformed. It could also be that a secret came up, okay? Something that was underneath the surface that some of you both avoided came up, okay? Um... And this change, whatever it was or whatever that came to the surface, it transformed this connection, okay? And this is what this has to do with. So what I'm getting here is that you put down some seeds, Taurus, okay? So like you in your mind um, could be manifesting, okay, Taurus? You could have been, you know, trying to manifest. You put prayers out there. You put wishes out there into um, having a grounded relationship, okay, or a romantic relationship with someone, okay? You thought it was somebody, but come to find out something changed, something ended. Um, and I also see that something that was repressed came to the forefront so something that was going on came now this could be a secret it could also be like um <clears throat> the depths of this connection okay something that has to do with the depths depths of this connection all right so let's see what the person that is thinking about you what energies they are in with this deck of cards all right Spirit, what does Taurus need to know about the person that is on, that is thinking about Taurus right now? <clears throat> okay. Wow. You know, I saw you as the Eight of Swords, and you are 
it's funny because this person, whoever they are, um, they feel stuck in something, okay? So this person, Taurus, for some reason, they have, you know, this is interesting. I don't know who this is. I don't know if this is the past person, okay? You're going to know that this is a general reading, guys, but this is someone who, this could be a newer energy, okay? So this is someone, Taurus, that has come into your life, okay? There was something about future talk, okay? Or future plans, okay? That were kind of avoided by this person, okay? So I don't know what happened. Maybe you met someone, Taurus. Maybe you started dating someone, okay? And then the future plans were kind of like, I just heard put a lid on. So someone put a lid on some type of future plans. Like this person, whoever they are, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? They came in very passionate. Um, this is someone who is very intense, okay? Their, their energy is so intense, Taurus, okay? Um, I do feel that some of you really like the energy of this person because they were passionate. They were like oh, lively. Um, they seemed like affectionate. Um, they were fun. You like this person. They're well-rounded. Okay, that kind of energy. But I feel like this person, there's something about the future, okay, that came up that they feel like they're holding, like they're overthinking, over worrying, over analyzing something to do with the future. So it could be that you, some future talk came up and you both were not on the same page, Taurus. Okay. So let's see. What, tell me more. Okay. This is so interesting. Whoa, okay, everything's coming up. Okay, Taurus, so there, this person, um, I'm seeing a three of swords, so that is Libra energy also. Um, this person, whoever they are, there is some sort of heartbreak from the past, okay? I feel like this person, okay, I just heard... They gave and gave in another connection and they got their heart broken or they were disappointed. Um, this person needs healing at this time, okay? So I feel that this person, and some of you, you, you might have gotten ghosted by this person is what I'm hearing. Let me know in the comments if um, that resonates with you because this is very interesting energy. This person, whoever they are, Okay, you know what it feels like? It feels like, okay, this person thought they were ready. So they started to connect with you, Taurus. They thought they were ready for a connection, a relationship, whatever. They came in really hot and heavy, um, like passionate, intense, not hot and heavy in a bad way, guys. Okay, so they came in that way because they were trying to manifest you, okay? They manifested you. Like, they wanted something of the same way you wanted Taurus. But then all of a sudden, I feel that this person was like, you know what? When it came down, like, you know what it feels like? They got cold feet, okay? And I, I'm seeing this person withdraw from you. And what are they thinking while they're withdrawing, okay? They feel that, they feel, you know, sad. They feel, um, a lot of you, this person feels lonely right now, okay? Um, and the other thing is that this person is realizing that they're not confident enough at the time. So whoever this was, I feel like a lot of you are in separation from this person. Let me know in the comments because... I don't know how long it's been. For some of you, it's been like three weeks. I'm hearing three, three months. 
I don't know if it's three years. I'm not picking up old, really old energy, but it could be. Um, there is a significance here when it comes to telepathy, okay? Um, you could be seeing this person's name everywhere, okay? They could be seeing your name everywhere, okay? Um, they are being reminded of you as you both are separated, okay? And this person now, I feel like when it, they think about a connection with you, like a real solid connection, Taurus, they kind of feel like, yeah, okay. You're out of their league, okay? You're out of their league, Taurus. That's how this person feels. Tell me more about that spirit because this person thought they, like, I keep getting this person was, like, ready. They thought they're going to do this, okay? Like, I want to... You know, I want a relationship. I want someone to wake up next to and all that stuff. And now they don't think like that, okay? This person does not have enough confidence within themselves and faith within themselves to put, like, that effort, okay? Um, this person could have just, like, fall, fell, fallen off the earth. Uh, Taurus, they could have ghosted you, okay, for some of you. Oh, we got justice again, Libra. We got Aries here, Scorpio. Oh my God, this is interesting. Taurus, so this person really feels like you're their, you're their soulmate, okay? This person feels that they, oh, this feels so like soulful energy. Okay. Whoever this is, Taurus, they are, they have some type of a job that they could be the boss at their work, okay? Or they could be like the business owner. Um, they're responsible for something. Like they're somewhere in a rank that it's high, okay? I just heard military. So somebody could be in the military also. It doesn't have to be, guys. Um, biz, I keep hearing business, business. So this person... <coughs> excuse me, is going through something at work right now. I have really bad allergies, guys, so bear with me. This person is going through something at work that requires them to, like, they're kind of tired of it or they got to do something at work. That's really affecting them and their free time also. It's like putting um, more uh, responsibility on them. But Taurus... This person feels so connected to you. Now, for some of you who are thinking like, who is this person? Taurus, this could be someone you just started talking to. Like it could be someone who you met. Some of you met them online, um, you know, online dating, dating app, whatever. Um, so this person right now, I feel is really consumed with work but they are they feel like they lost you okay so spirit tell us what's the next move of this person probability okay for taurus okay huh you showed up in the reading taurus and we got lovers on the bottom so, okay, guys, so I feel like this person really needs to change up things a bit, a bit, okay? I feel like this person just ran away from change, okay? It's kind of like Taurus, this person, when it came down to like the really making the move um, that okay, like, this could be my forever person, you know, I keep hearing that, like, this could be the person that I'm going to spend my life with kind of energy, so this person is very calculated, is what Spirit said, so I feel like they kind of pulled back their energy, because they're, they thought they were ready for this change, but they were not, 
okay? Um, keep in mind, this is a timeless reading. You, Some of you, I feel like a few of you have not even met this person yet, okay? So you're like, who is Empire talking about? But <clears throat> this is you. You're the Hierophant, Taurus, okay? Um, this person right now is really learning something. And for some of you, this person could even be getting counseling, okay? Um, I just heard license. Okay, licensor, or they're trying to get a license for something. Um, this person is trying really hard to open up to the idea of commitment and marriage because they have wounds from the past, okay? I just heard they have domestic wounds. So some of you could be dealing with someone who had family issues, okay? So let's see. When is there a possibility this is going to happen? Okay, I'm going to ask again. For some of you, this could be a Cancer, Libra, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini. We got all this. Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. I said Libra. Yeah. There is definitely a lot of stress when it comes to um, this person and you. Okay, I'm going to cover this. Apparently, they don't like nude stuff here. And dude, this is the star, guys. Okay. Well, I'm telling you, this person on the higher planes, they are connecting to you. You might be dreaming of them, Taurus, or they're dreaming of you. Okay. In the ethers, you all are connecting somehow, some way. So that tells me you're dreaming of them. You're seeing their, you know, like synchronicities. Okay. I just saw 1010. Um, 1111, the, the significant of the number 20 is um, coming up, 777, 717, um, that is significant, 6 is significant, but what I'm seeing here is that there's something going on behind the scenes when it comes to spirit overlooking this connection, okay? And we got the two of cups twice. So this could be that person that something happened with, like something all of a sudden just ended between you two, okay? A disconnection. And this person here, there's a lot of interference in their life right now, okay? Now, some of you are like, don't make up excuses. If they want you, they can... But... Listen, guys, um, I feel like this person has some things to learn. I feel like they have some things to heal, but they're very connected to you, okay? They wish to be with you, okay? And moon. There's a lot that's going on beneath the surface that you do not see it within this person. There's a lot of healing. This could also be um, feminine wounding, Taurus, but there are breakthroughs. I feel like when this person deals with all this stuff, they're going to come through with some type of communication to you. That passion that they had when they met you, Taurus, is going to be revived. Okay? Okay which is great news. The two aces together is like definitely a breakthrough, a positive breakthrough within this person, with between you and this person, whoever they are, okay? I do feel soulmate energy. Like you could have met this person and thought, oh my God, this is my person. And they met you and they're like, this is my person, okay? Because there was so much passion and then all of a sudden it kind of like it was not there anymore, okay? But it is coming back, Okay. The passion will be revived, Taurus. I don't know who this is. Let me know in the comments. Um, this is somebody who you felt really good vibes with when you just met them. You're like, whoa, who is this? Like it felt magical, okay? Taurus, I hope that you enjoyed this. If it's helped you in any way, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe if you already have not. And peace out.